Hi coaches, Ron Silico here. What I want to do in this video presentation is talk about the 1-4 offense and in this video particularly talk about the wing series. And we call it the wing series basically because the offense is initiated on a pass from the point to either this wing or this wing. So this is our setup in the 1-4 offense. We've got a 1-4 high alignment where our 3, our 2, our four and our five are all above the foul line or just at the foul line and foul line extended. Okay, Three things we're going to talk about are, is what happens when there's a low post feed, a high post feed, and we reverse the ball back to the point. So we're going to start the offense with a point to wing entry, which starts the wing series. In this situation, the ball has gone to the three, so the strong side post goes to the block and post up. Now we don't want that post posting any lower than the big block at the bottom of the foul line lane uh, because we want that post, if they do catch the ball, to be able to go baseline or middle with drop steps and have good angles at the basket. After that pass is made, the one man is going to cut right off the four looking for a lob to the basket. And quite often especially early in the game when the defense isn't used to this, that pass is going to be open. So you need to train your wingmen to make a good look for that and make a good lob pass if necessary. Our two-man is going to rotate up. In this, in this alignment, the guards are always going to rotate around the perimeter, and our posts are going to work opposite of each other. So you can see we've got a nice triangle here for a post entry, and we have a nice triangle here with the high post feed. Okay. You may want to do things different, but what we do on post feeds is, let me, let me draw this now. So the ball's, the ball's on our wing. So we've got our two man up top and our one man is rotated out. Our three man makes a low post feed down low we want for not only for rebounding purposes, but there may also be a scoring opportunity. Is whenever there's a low post feed, we want our other post diving to the basket and filling that weak side block for for rebounding potential. So in this case, the post feed has been made. We want our four man to dive. Again, you may do things different, but we want our perimeter players scissoring off post feeds. So after our three man has made the pass here. He scissors with our two man, and this may open a situation if three, if three's man has gone to double the post. Got a nice screen situation here, two coming off of it. But we like to scissor off the post on any time there's a low post feed. Okay, so that's what happens when there's a low post feed. Our rule is we want our four diving backside looking for rebounds, and also there may be an initial feed on that basket cut. Okay, we draw it here. Let's say the post feed is not available. So we've had our four set the back screen. The whole purpose of this back screen is we're looking for the high-low game, and we love the high-low game. So let's say the defender is, being, is fronting our low post man right there. If the four sets a good back screen, we should have a nice entry into the high-low into the high-low game. So the pass goes here. We could have our four go right to the corner of the backboard with a nice touch lob pass. Five man getting a bucket. If the five man is being defended behind, the ball goes to the four. We want that five man on air time on that pass going from the wing to the high post, ducking right in and looking for a post feed high low right there. If neither one of these are open, the ball gets reversed back to the point, which is the third thing that we want to talk about. So let me erase the four having the ball there. Let me erase these high-low feeds. So this basically sig signals a restart to the offense. Our five-man is down low. Three-man is reverse the ball back to the point position. Our four goes to the elbow, and our five comes up to the other elbow. Now we could reverse the ball to the one and start the wing series, or we can make an entry into one of these post positions and start the post series, which we're going to talk about in the next video. But that is the 14 wing series. You can see it's very basic, very basic movements, 
but it is really intended as a power offense. And you can also use this wing series against zones. You can find holes in the zones. You've got posts that are operating. Sometimes we have the posts go to the short corner, and then we have our other posts work the elbow area, work the paint. But you could have these these bigs working in that working the zone, and then we've got our guards working on the perimeter. So that is the 14 wing series.